Hi everyone! Today we are going to be talking about binomial nomenclature. But what is binomial nomenclature? Well, it's a formal system used to name species that includes their genus and specific epithet. You might be wondering, how do I distinguish between this genus and the specific epithet in binomial nomenclature? Well, let me show you an example with Lamium purpureum L, otherwise known as dead nettle, which is a super common lawn weed. The first part of the Latin binomial will be what genus the species is a member of. In this case, it is Lamium. The second part of the Latin binomial is the specific epithet. This is used to distinguish a species from other members of its genus. In this case, the specific epithet is purpurium. Now, the genus and specific epithet together are considered the Latin binomial. However, you can take it a step further and add what is called an authority. An authority is an abbreviation that represents the individual who named the species. In this case, L stands for Carl Linnaeus, who is actually the one who invented the binomial nomenclature system. Something you may have noticed is that the Latin binomial is italicized, but the authority is not. This is correct. The authority is never italicized, but the Latin binomial should always be. The only exception is if the species name is being written on paper. If you are writing the name down, the Latin binomial should be underlined instead of being italicized. The authority does not get underlined. Now, what if someone made a revision to a species name? We can see an example of that here with Gymnocletus dioecus LK coach, or the Kentucky coffee tree. First, let's spot our Latin binomial. Gymnocletus is our genus, dioecus is our specific epithet. Now what is that L in the parentheses? That is our parental authority, which marks who is the first to use that specific epithet for the species. But someone else made a change to the name of the species. If we recall from earlier, L stands for Linnaeus, so he originally described the species. Now the name outside of the parentheses is called the combining authority. This is the person who was second to use the specific epithet for a species and made a change to the name of the species. K. Koch stands for Karl Koch, who is a German botanist. That is all for this video. I will have a list of the vocabulary words that we went over in the comments section. Thank you all for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like and subscribe.